Hello folks, today I'm going to talk about activating a computer after you either reinstalled Windows or changed your hardware significantly. Now you can do this, in order to do this actually, you have to have a Microsoft account and you have to have activated after your Microsoft account was set up on the computer. And what that does is that stores a digital copy of your license in your Microsoft account. So what I'm going to do here is I'm, I've changed my hardware up and I'm going to reinstall Windows and then I'm going to activate but I'm going to show you how to activate without having to use a different product key or to purchase another product key. We're going to activate using the existing license stored in our Microsoft account. So I'm going to break here, reinstall Windows and then I'll come back to you when I'm ready to activate. Okay folks, so I'm back and I've reinstalled Windows and I've installed all my drivers, device drivers. You may or may not need to do that depending on the uh, age of your PC. If it's fairly new, you may need to do that. Notice how I get this message when I go into PC settings that Windows isn't activated. Activate Windows now. So I'm going to go ahead and click on that. Then I'm going to select Troubleshoot. Then I'm going to select, I changed the hardware on this device recently. Next it's going to come up with my Microsoft account. Here's my video production machine. Obviously I'm not going to activate with either one of those. But you can see these are both stored on my Microsoft account. So if I selected one of these devices, it would allow me to activate my copy of Windows. Okay. We can see all the devices here. If I go there, we can see all the devices I had here. I had a couple with Windows 10 Home installed, and then I had one with Windows 10 Single Language. But I'm not going to actually activate this right now using any of those. This is just for the purposes of this video. So, that's how you activate and again in the setup you don't want to put a product key in but that's how you activate if you're reinstalling Windows or if you've changed the hardware in your computer and your computer suddenly saying hey this copy of Windows is not activated this is how you reactivate as always folks if you like this video please give it a thumbs up we greatly appreciate that click the subscribe button and you'll get notified whenever we add new content and as always, comments, questions, and suggestions are welcome below, and we thank you very much for watching.